crystal stone art paint has clear texture. It has a vivid stone texture and is moisture-proof and mildew-proof. Meanwhile, it is water-based and environmentally friendly. Crystal stone art paint can create multiple texture effects. The following is a detailed introduction to the bulk pattern effect construction process of 3 Shades Crystal Stone Art Paint. The following is a schematic diagram of the coating structure. The main tools that workers need to prepare include short hair roller, diatom mud slick roller, stainless steel elastic art knife, and sandpaper. The first step, base layer treatment. Please confirm that the base layer must be dry, firm, and level before construction. Pre-grind and remove dust. The second step is to roll the primer. Use the special penetrating primer for 3 trees art paint. Add 10 to 20% water to the primer. Use a short hair roller brush to apply the primer. The dosage is 1.12 kg per square meter. The third step, scraping crater stone art paint for the first time. Add 0 to 10% water to crystal stone art paint. Use the stainless steel elastic art batch knife to evenly scrape the crystal stone art paint. The scraping thickness is the size of a sand grain, and the dosage is 0.7 kg per square meter. Wait until it's completely dry before proceeding to the next step of construction. In severe humid environments, determine according to the actual situation. The fourth step, the second batch of scraping crystal stone art paint and making texture. For the second time, use the stainless steel microelastic art batch knife to evenly scrape the crystal stone art paint. In order to enhance the three-dimensional effect of the subsequent bulk texture, the second batch of scraping art paint needs to be thicker than the first. And the thickness is 2 sand grains, the dosage is about 2 kg per square meter. After scraping, use a light body roller to roll the coated surface to form an irregular bulk texture effect on the surface. Pay attention to the natural transition at the joints. Note that if a large area of the wall is to be horizontally textured, two people must cooperate, one scrapes in batches, and the other draws the texture to prevent stubble from drying too fast. After the coating is 80% dry, use a knife to gently flatten the raised texture along the direction of the grain to achieve the basic effect. The fifth step, sandpaper sanding. After the wall is completely dry, use 240 to 320 grit sandpaper to lightly sand the coated surface. The sixth step, rolling the top coating. Use a short haired roller brush to roll coat the three trees art paint with overcoat varnish. To complete the work in one pass, 
and the dosage is about 0.1 kg per square meter. Review of construction key points. The first batch of scraping is 1 cent particle size. The second batch of scraping needs to be thicker than the first one, and the thickness is the size of 2 cent grains. The joints of texture should be natural to avoid obvious construction marks. Pay attention to the corners, do not accumulate waste. The construction personnel must cooperate with each other, and the construction of one wall must be completed at one time.